Vintage Jewels. It's uh, John here from LA Mazda. So here's the 2013, here's the 2016. Let's get into the 2013 first. Where is it? 3.5 liter V6 engine, so you're gonna get up and go no problem. About 260 horsepower, 145 pounds of torque, so you're gonna get awesome fuel economy and the power to get up and go. You got your uh, maintenance uh, schedules and everything all in black and yellow, as you can tell. A dipstick, everything nice and easy. I'll show you that when you do come on in. Come on over here. You got the coats on the side, you got the door, uh, mirrors folded and everything back here got nice leather and everything myself it's 511 six foot i can easily hop in here as i pulled the vehicle up and you can see i have ample amount of headroom and ample amount of headroom with a panoramic sunroof in here and the sunroof over there as well hopping out you got your backup camera and ample amount of storage space and everything you drop down the seats with your uh, left and right system right here nice little cubbies for a camping or whatever summer may come at and ship with over here, we get my camera guy to hop in here. I'll show you the inside. So, pop on in, turn this off real quick. Infotainment sensor right here, climate, entertainment, heated seats, phone, Bluetooth, CD player, because I know they're obsolete, but this one has it for you. Max AC, everything. It's basically heat touch sensitive to do all that good stuff. Bluetooth on this side, cruise control on this side, power locks, power windows, power mirrors. I'll show you that backup camera right there on the 7.4 screen and the sunroof I already depicted to you as well. It's only 190, ugh, 119,000 kilometers on this one, but almost 120,000. But with that being said, we have a great deal lined up for you. Now, let's take a look at the 2016 for you. As you can see, this one has a little bit better body style, a little bit more sleek, a little bit more sporty. Everything you got the LED daytime running lights on the bottom, halogen headlamps for your high beams, and projection beams for your daytime running lights. Underneath the hood here is still the 3.5 liter. Oops. Just like that, everything nice and easy. Upon purchase, you do get a full tank and a full detailed clean, so it won't look like this. Sorry about the dirt. And am I right? Am I right? Yes, it is a 3.5 liter. Come on over here. We'll go to the back. Popping in. So, a little bit more room in this one. You can see the seat's a little bit concaved. Uh, obviously, we can put that back on there. Don't worry about that. Ample amount of headroom. Obviously, this one has sunroofs. So this one doesn't. Come around over here. So, we've got the backup camera. Ample amount of storage space. You can drop your seats left and right, right there. 12 volt if you want to put a fridge in here. <laughs> we'll drop it down, all wheel drive. Get my camera guy up in here, I'll show you the features on the inside. Already they're jewels. So, you got the heated seats up front, everything's all touched, electric park brake. USBs, nice little cubby for your change. Climate control, audio control, phone, everything nice and easy. Bluetooth, cruise no control. Connected. I know that. And then uh, unlock, power windows, power locks, everything nice and easy. A nice little storage space up there too. And this one only has 33,796 kilometers. So if there's anything else that I could possibly do to help you out, feel free to give me a call at 780-222-7501. Thanks Jules, take care.